Okay, we're going to install a topper. This is a marine grade Sumbrella toppers that we got from RB Slide Toppers. And also might note too that when we when we do this, you'll notice the slide is only halfway out. Uh, we do that so we can get to everything and you'll have a two, two girths of welt cords, the big and the little. And uh, then we use this, these, it's like a canvas type material we get from these guys and holds up a lot better. It's waterproof. Uh, mildew resistant and so by taking it out of the how we do this taking a shaft out, a lot of people will drill this shaft out here will drill this out this hole where, where he's starting it right here we'll, they'll drill it out with a drill but by doing it this way by pinning the end and taking it out you can move it around to us it makes it a little bit easier and it keeps the welt in the topper from coming back out of the shaft. And with these new toppers, the way that, that Chris and the guys sew it, um, it's just amazing. It slides in. Almost one guy can do it. If you would have to replace these with the vinyl, especially in cold weather, it would be almost impossible for one guy and it's very difficult. Um, this, this slides in. And if we you have one guy feeding and one guy pulling. And if we measure this correctly, it'll go down where it needs to be. And sometimes and also if you hold on a second. If you'll note right here you can see we have a Chris and he'll put a industrial staple right there that keeps the the welt from moving inside the material and they also sew the welt in too and put hems on each end. So they do a they do a real good job. And sometimes you have the the back awning rail is a little tight and where the old screws are at you have to adjust that just, just a little bit to to get it to, to go in. And uh a lot, of, a lot of places, instead of putting set screws, will actually put, uh, they wind up pinching those, show them right there, so clearly they'll, they'll pinch that together, that rail right there. But we don't do that. When we get finished, we'll put tape on the edges and uh, <laughs> we will put set screws in the back. So we will get this set up and then we will finish install it on the next video.